Hello children, how are you all? I hope you all are doing very, very well. Children, we all live in houses and the place which is near to our houses is called our neighborhood. And the people who live in that house, who live in our house, what do we call them? They are called our neighbors. Children, we all love to have good neighbors, helping neighbors. But there are some places in our neighborhood which makes our neighborhood a good place to live. Children, a good neighbor is what? A good neighborhood is when we have all the services which we require in our day-to-day -day life like market, hospital, post office, fire station, all are near to our house so that we can avail those services whenever we need them. We need not to travel long distance to avail those services. So children, these services, if are at our neighborhood, makes our life much comfortable and easier. So children, today, through this chapter, we will study the chapter near the neighborhood. Let's begin. Children, first I will talk about the place which is very, very essential so that we can buy our essential things very easily. So this place is market. There are many shops in a market which has different, different things so that we can buy whatever thing we need. Firstly and majorly, what I require? I require vegetables, fruits in our day-to-day -day life. If I have to travel and if it is not in our neighborhood, life would be easy. No, it would be very difficult. So if I want to buy fruits, vegetables or anything, to whom I will go? I will go to the grocery shop. Next, if you want urgently some papers and pens and the market in the market, there is no stationary shop. Life would be easy. No, it won't be easy. So you can avail all the pencils, highlighters or anything which is related to your stationery from the stationery shop in the market very easily. Next is the chemist shop. In the market, there is always a chemist shop. You can get medicines very easily from the chemist shop if the market is near to your house. Agar aapko apne friend ke birthday ke liye ek cake buy karna hai, to aap kaha se buy karoge? From the confectionery shop? Or agar market hamari neighborhood mein nahi hogi, will you able to buy? No. So children, if market is one of the essential place which should be in your neighborhood, if you have a good neighborhood. Students, now next is one of the essential place which is very important to have in your neighborhood. Hospital. So children, one day your grandparent fall ill. There is no one in the house. What you will do if there is no hospital nearby? And if there is a hospital nearby, you can easily take your grandparent to the hospital and treat him. So hospital have a doctor it has a nurse doctor can easily treat your grandparent and the nurse take care of the ill patient children some neighborhoods have a special clinic also from where we can easily get the medicines these clinics are called dispensaries even for the people who cannot afford these dispensaries gives the free medicines also so children having a hospital is very essential near your house. Children, next we will study about banks. Children, we cannot keep our valuable things like jewelry, money all in our house because there is always a threat that some intruder or thief may enter the house and steal that valuable item. So for that purpose, there is a bank service to which you can avail and keep your valuable items and money safely. Also, bank providers various services like if you want to start something and you don't have money, you can borrow money from the bank as well. This is known as loans. Next, children, we talk about police station. Children, it is one of the important places that should be in our neighborhood. Children, if someday some mishappening occurs with any one of us, there should be always a police station. Children, it is one of the important place that should be in our neighborhood. Police 
maintains the law and order in the society it also protects us from the thieves and intruders and children a policeman who is in the police station helps us in catching thieves or protect us from thieves and intruders children police always helps us in trouble times so this is one of the places that should be in our neighborhood children now we talk about fire station children suddenly one day you notice a fire in a nearby house what you will do to whom you will call for help you will call yes fire station a fire station has fire fighters they come in a red fire engines and put off the fire and protects everyone's life so children always and always remember the number of fire station and what, whenever you notice something smoke or fire in any area call that number urgently now children we will talk about a place which i'm sure every child loves going to there and play with their friends yes park children a park has many trees and plants around which gives us fresh air and also walking paths to walk children park also have swings which you all i'm sure enjoy so children park is one of the essential place that should be in your neighborhood so that children can enjoy and the elder people or your mother father can go for a walk and inhale fresh air children now let's study together the another important and essential place post office children suppose one day your brother is out of town and it is a occasion of raksha bandhan what you will do you will wait him to come or you will send your rakhi on the day of raksha bandhan yes through post office you can easily send your parcel or any gift greetings to the person you want to send children you can also buy stamps envelopes children post office has a postman he is a person who delivers your parcels to the place you want to send children also it has many services also you can send your money from one place to another very easily through money order so children you have seen how important is post office how easily you can post your things or articles or uh, parcels to the other person you want to send so children through this chapter you have learned the importance of different places in your neighborhood in our day to day life we don't actually realize the importance of having those places in our neighborhood but these places actually makes our life very comfortable and smooth so children with this this is the end of today's session i'll see you in the next session thank you